Okay, well, I'm back with some more Victoria 2. Uh, when last I left you, I had just driven off a bunch of Austrians with, uh, with my army. But I have kind of an untenable position here in the long run. Oh, these are all transports, right. Um, so I'll split you in half. And let's see, where could I get myself another army? Yeah, over here. That'll help a lot. Let's take a look. Why am I not doing things with them yet? Okay, right. I want to wait until I have that hundred. Ugh, we're not doing great in this war, are we? And this is one where I'm not going to be able to just turn it around super easy. Well, we're doing okay. We have... Oh no, we're, we are actually winning. And the, uh... The, you know, army size is on our side, so that's good. I'm not quite on board enough that I'm going to probably mobilize, but... You know... I will bring in some troops from, like, Africa. Because that's not a super important place to have armies for me right now. Cool, we've occupied Venice. Actually, no, let's sit here for a while and let the troops recover. You know, before we worry about venturing out more, if they can reinforce a little bit, that will help a quite a lot. Now, this fleet, you split up two, and let's get that last port of theirs so they have a complete blockade. I'm gonna keep an eye on... here we go. This is the fleet arrival we were really waiting for. Get on the boats, and you sail up here. I'm gonna keep an eye on that. Um, yeah, let's get our... Our pops over in Africa to not have uh, militancy issues. What do I really want here? And do I want to save, maybe? Save up uh, points. I don't think I need to save up points, no. Um, let's get time-saving measures. Maybe. Or... Oh, do I want electricity instead? I mean, that would get me... Yeah, I want electr... Or the steam turbine. Oh yeah, because combustion engine will be available. Let's, let's catch up there. Okay, see, this army has started to recover a bit. Let's, let's take the more healthy uh, units. Even the ones that don't have enough to reinforce anymore. You know, they'll, they'll be good for the moment while they fight. And besides, they can't reinforce anymore anyway, so no need to keep them uh, around with the recovering army. This will do. For now give you your own leader, and just sit you, what's the terrain in some of these places, hills, hills, okay, and I've had more troops arrive. So, let's take the fleet that has men in it, 
And... Oh, did I, did I do the dumb thing I do sometimes where I don't actually pick up? Could have sworn I picked up. No, okay, I did. I didn't do that. I think... Let's merge you together. Yeah, okay, I do have the troops. Good. I was about to be... Like, ah, oh, I'm such an idiot again. Once you guys recover a bit more, I'll march you up into Treviso, I think. And hopefully that'll be pretty helpful. But we'll see, won't we? Okay, started another occupation. Okay, let's see. Oh, close. Okay, UK is still not quite where they can, like, ban us or anything. Okay, I'd say you're mostly recovered enough. So how about you march up? to Treviso. That'll help. And these will form a nice army that I could maybe ship over. In fact, why not? Split in half again. And half of you come over here to get troops. Discredited in Brazil. I'm actually pretty happy about that, um, because it means they're not going to use it on other... Ooh! The, uh... The Witwaters and Gold Rush is happening, so that means I'll be able to annex Transvaal. Is there anyone who's going to care enough to try to stop me? I bet not. Oh, you are allied with the UK. That's a bit rough. But I can beat the UK. I think. I mean, technically, they've... well, let's see. Yeah, I think I can beat the UK. Especially because I bet NGF is happy enough with me that they would help. Yeah, all my allies would help. Good. Because the UK's got a swarm of them. Um, NGF is actually not all that strong. Really quickly, let's see if there's any other allies in the region, that, or anywhere really, that I could grab that would be of use. You know, let's, let's not... Um, for example, well, Netherlands probably wouldn't, because we were at war for a while, yeah. Italy... They're in France's sphere, so I doubt it. Um, Brazil is allied with UK. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna need to go with what I've got. Do I have any troops available for that campaign? Okay, I guess I'll have to use my troops up and see. That is kind of the difficulty here. Okay. I'm gonna have to pull a lot of my navy away from uh, in this campaign, I think. And probably some of my armies as well. Still, um, overall, I think I've done enough to mess with Austria that, you know, I... Like, this isn't a hugely important war to me, is the thing. Like, I just want my ally to be strong so that they can help me in the future. But... If it comes to it, 
I'm perfectly willing to withdraw from this war to make sure I win a war that I care more about. Um, let's bring in my actual, like, ironclads. There we go. There we go. And... Let's see. This fleet has arrived in Lisbon. Oh no, just more troops that were trained have arrived there. Move on the occupation of Treviso. Oh, here comes a large Austrian army. Have you got a decent general? Yeah, you do. So I'll wait till you actually arrive and then I'll reinforce. There you are. They should be pretty dug in, right? Yep, and in fact, I don't need to reinforce with that much infantry. So what I'll do is I'll send in all the artillery. Oh, I guess I don't have that much infantry. This army is not really built properly. Too many backline troops. I'll just send everyone in then. There we go. And there's a crisis in Finland, which is great because I am not in a war right now. Whew. Uh, no one wants to do the crisis, though. No one cares. That's too bad. That would have been quite helpful for me. Oh, well. well like I said, my main focus now is going to be on getting down into Africa so I can annex Transvaal. How long do I have? So I want to make sure I don't lose my opportunity. Um, I have until December. Okay. Well, I won't need too much to deal with Transvaal itself. The potential issue here is UK, if they choose to get involved. Hmm? Uh, let's do this. Keep those two armies mostly together. And you sail down this way as well. Um, I can gain Humiliate on the USA. Nah. I don't want to fight the USA. That just seems like not the plan for me. Okay. We'll march in there really quickly. And yes, we're attacking, but that's okay because they have like no organization. Ugh, when I start off with rolling a zero, though. That's okay, though. It's, it's not a big deal. Man, they're, they're out-rolling me seriously here. It's good, though, that they don't really have much in the way of artillery. Now Poland has declared war on NGF. Man! Okay, I'll help you with Poland. Man, we're now the war leader against Poland. Ugh. Oh. This is just too much. I'm... I'm kind of willing to just let you... Yeah, sorry, NGF. <laughs> this is just too much. I might end up having to dump you as an ally. 
I mean, you're just getting wrecked. Wrecked so hard. That... <laughs> Honestly, I kind of want out of... Well, no, we're... We're winning the war against Austria. How far are these fleets? Because I would like to get this war going against Transvaal. Okay. They're both about to arrive. And I, I, I get the feeling UK is going to honor their alliance here. But that's okay. You need a leader. Eh, you'll do. Doesn't need to be a great leader, just needs to be a good enough leader. So let's go ahead and declare conquest on Transvaal. Zulu will not accept. That's okay, Zulu's not gonna be much help anyway. And now I'm at war with a bunch of people. Because you- oh no, UK did not bring a whole bunch of allies. I mean they've got... Do I do- yeah, well, we'll see. We'll see what happens, but hopefully this is a pretty easy war. Oh shit, what's happening now? Call ally from Peru. I I can't deal with that right now. That's too much. Okay, so now UK is mobilizing. Yeah, let's go ahead and start evacuating troops. And we probably need to mobilize now. Uh, what's the UK fleet situation right now? They've got 54 ships. Okay. So yeah, they're, they're occupying some of my stuff in the east, and I'm just gonna have to kind of accept that. Who's this arm? Okay, good. They're just taking attrition because of sieging. And yeah, they can occupy colonies if they really want to. I'm not too worried about it. No, I did uh, manage to take here. And we'll move up like this and take uh, that province as well. An army has arrived in... Oh man, there's a big uh, British fleet here. I've got 11 heavies, 19 lights, 18 transports. Yeah, let's, uh, let's move in to support this battle. This is a major part of the UK fleet, it looks like. So if we can get... We don't have an admiral here. Hopefully... No, they don't have one either. Oh, man. You come help as well. Let's just make sure we crush that fleet. Meanwhile, since we can't pick you up right now, you move into the mountains. And that'll be fine. And I think... Once I, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here, and in the next one I should be able to win this war, I think. I mean, overall, um, yeah, we outnumber them a whole lot. 
So thank you for watching and have a good day.